Growing up in Iraq, Hassan Talib's teenage years were scarred by war. Now he wants to help his country heal and rebuild. It's a mission that's brought him all the way to the U.S. Capitol to witness democracy in action. The diversity will make you guys stronger. I think the diversity is a good thing for, the, for every country. It's a challenge for you to say, how do we make that work yeah. to our advantage in Iraq? And, and we will make that work. Thomas Jefferson in the center. Hassan is one of about 50 Iraqi university students invited to the U.S. for a summer exchange program. It's funded by the U.S. State Department. Because an effective team... Through team-building workshops, leadership training, and community service projects, a diverse group of Iraqi Christians and Muslims, Arabs and Kurds, are brought together to glimpse the patchwork of American life. Vian Aga, a medical student, was one of 500 to apply. She says even the simplest values she's observed here, like being on time, could help her country function more smoothly. Can 50 students coming here and going back to Iraq really make a difference? Yeah, we can make a difference because when you tell your friend and the, your friend is going to tell his friend or her friend, and it's just like it's just a circle is going to get bigger and bigger. Of course, the idea of an exchange is that learning goes both ways. When you say, I'm an Iraqi, What's the reaction? <laughs> when they ask me, like, do you go by camel to a university? And I was like, I'm going to be a dentist. I have my own car. <laughs> this next generation of Iraqi leaders say they'll stay united back at home. After all, in the U.S., they've seen a country made up of many which can work together as one. Seth Doan, CBS News, Washington.